Well, this year we've seen to have a lot of bad storms. And of course, when you have bad storms, you usually end up with power outages. And power outages nowadays are a little bit more than an inconvenience. It's a big problem. So many of us work at home. We have medical equipment at home. And plus, who likes to come home to a really hot or really cold home? Now, of course, you've seen portable generators, but what we're going to help you with today is getting a standby generator. We'll help you size it to your home. We'll learn all about it. In fact, let me introduce you to Vic Spang. He is with Buckeye Power Sales. Okay. Thanks for having us out, Vic. I appreciate it. What is a standby generator? What, what does this do? Well, the purpose of a standby generator is that it comes on automatically, much like what you said, instead of a portable generator where you have an outage, have to come out, start the generator, plug it into a receptacle, and plug your appliances into it. A whole house generator such as this starts automatically when you lose power. The automatic transfer switch, which we'll talk about later, sure. kind of conducts that back and forth, and you don't have to do a darn thing, sir. Well, recently we were out at a home. We actually tested one to see how it works. So let's take a look at that. When I pull this switch, we're going to be in the dark for just a few seconds. All right, well, go ahead and pull it. All right, so the storm blew in. We have an ice storm. The, the tree limb fell across the wire. Uh, you know, the computers go out. My refrigerator isn't working. My, my sump pump uh, could be overflowing, ruining my basement. There you That's go. That's it? That is it. That is it. 10 to 12 seconds, you're on. So what now we're not running on power. Uh, we're not running on the municipal power, if you will. We're actually running on the generator? On the generator. Very cool. Yes, sir. Very, that is uh -huh. very cool. Yep. And this will monitor the power, and then when it comes back and stabilizes, you'll see the green light come on, which would simulate your utility. The generator would retransfer back and you'll be uh, back on utility power as normal. It, 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 wow, it's all automatic. How great is that? You could be out of town, still have power. Wow, that is really cool how that generator works. I love that. Let's talk about different sizes of the generators, Vic, because we have choices. And what do we have here? Well, Gary, this is our 18 kW generator, 18,000 watts. It's our most popular style, popular size generator runs off of natural gas and LP gas. Really? Yes. Now, what size home will this power? If I want to do my entire house, all the circuits, because folks, you have options. I want the refrigerator, the air conditioners, the lights and everything. What size home? 2,500 square foot or less is about the cutoff for this. You can handle up to a four ton air conditioner and the rest of your house. So that's a pretty good size home. Oh, yes, sir. Now, if I had a larger home, could I choose what circuits I want to do and still use this unit? Sure, selective. You could take your selective circuits, air conditioning, sump pump, refrigerator, freezer, the things that are important to you. Family room possibility if you want a place to huddle during an outage and just power up those items and be just fine. But a 2,500 square foot home, this would light, heat, cool, and yes, do sir. everything? Yes, All sir. right, now if I have a larger home and I want to power everything, you probably have one for me there oh, we too, sure right? we sure do. So Vic, what size of generator do we have here and what size home will that power? Well, this is a 30 kW, 30,000 watts. Again, runs off of natural gas or LP. And we're talking about something above 25 to maybe three, 3,500 square feet with two, three air conditioners. Sure, you run into that. Oh yes, oh yeah. Now these are Kohler products. Though. Oh yes, Kohler, Wisconsin, made in America. All right, very good. How about the maintenance on the units? Well, uh, maintenance, I'm glad you brought that up, Gary. Maintenance is a very important part of this. You're going to invest this type of money. You need to maintain it, much like your vehicle. You don't buy a car and not change the oil or take care of it. We offer a maintenance contract where we come out twice a year. A big part of our business. Sir. Sure. And we talked about the different size units for different homes. Of course, we have some very large homes, also businesses, and you certainly can take care of folks on that level too, right? Oh, sure. There's not a house we can't handle. And of course, another part of our business is the commercial and industrial side. So we're into hospitals, healthcare facilities, fire departments. Yes. All right. Well, I've got the big question. If power goes off, how does it go from my utility box to these guys? All right. Well, that's a whole different story over to the transfer switches. So these are the guys that transfer the power, huh? That's right, Gary. These are your automatic transfer switches typically mounted inside the house. Okay. And it's what gets the power from your generator into your house when you lose power at the utility. All right, now I notice there's a couple of different sizes. That depends on the size generator? It does, it does. It depends on whether you're powering up your whole house or different circuits, separate circuits. We have a switch that matches up with the generator. All right, that's your expertise. I'll let you handle that. How about the warranty on these units? Glad you asked, sir. Our 18 kW, five-year warranty, both on the generator and the transfer switch is a complete system, best in the business. Now, if you'd like to learn more about these Kohler standby generators, you can go to Vic's website. BuckeyePowerSales.com, where you can link onto that, find a dealer that's closest to your area, 
or you can always give us a buzz here at BuckeyePowerSales.com. Very good. Thanks for the tour. Appreciate it. You're welcome.